I couldn't knock him out. No, that's too risky. Let's just talk to him first. If he gets a little hosty, you'll knock him out. Hey, are you the guy? Yeah, I'm Tim. What is it? We want you to come with us. At talk. Outside. Um, sure. Is something wrong? We need you to join us in a group. Because we definitely need you, Tim. It's been so long since we tried finding you. We tried find finding your friend Oscar, but he refused. What do you want me for? Well, um, it's classified. But we talked to your friend Mason, and he agreed to join. Oh. Well, that's good. Well, um, I'm not sure going back. I've been in the island once. I'm not taking risk in my life to go back there. I'm sorry to feel that way. But you could ask your friend Billy if he likes to join. Oh uh, no, don't you even think about it calling him. He's my best friend and you are not sending him into that damn island. Well, you could take Mason if you like, but I'm not going back to that damn island. And don't expect me calling me around, because I'm not going in there. And hell, even though, don't even think about crying around like, Oh my god, I'm, we're screwed in that island, we need your help. Hey, turn around. Alright, what the hell do you want? Ugh, <laughs> damn. Billy? Hey man. Okay Tim, before you freak out, I need you to calm down. There's something that he should probably tell you. Where the hell am I anyway? You're in our base. We brought you here by force, but Billy agreed to, you know, sorry about the punch. And you got a lot of nerve knocking me the hell out. I don't care who you are, but you can count me on on this damn mission. I believe your little friend James is still alive. James? Jim is still alive. You know that island that we just ended up there? He survived. And we didn't even know that he was alive. He was in a coma. How do you know this? We found an unknown sound coming from around the island. And it seems to me that it could be a velociraptor call. But apparently, the velociraptor call never responded to some sort of like a radio communicator. You mean like a radio? Something like that. But we need your help. I need your help to bring him back home to safety. I I I I don't know. I, 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 he was my friend, and I I thought he was dead. It's our only best hope to get him back here, safety for your friend. What's your choice? Let's go get my friend back on one condition. Name it, man. If we're doing this, we'll do this my way. Because none of your men had no idea what these animals are capable of. Understand? Alright, Tim. Lead the way. Why the hell you look so damn calm? Shut up. You interrupted my sleep. By the way, they're in this way. Alright, people. We got a man to save. Let's get through this and ready to rock and roll. Sergeant, get our equipment ready. We're going to the island. I'll do that, sir. Hey, Mason. Good to see you. So, like, we're going back to the island, right? Well, yeah, man. Didn't they tell you? Tell me what? All right. We're ready. Let's do this. Just to remind you guys, we have weapons in the chopper and even supplies and food and water. So, if you guys need anything, let me know. Okay. Hey, are you nervous? No. Uh, okay. Because Mason is. Hey, Tim. Are you sure we can trust them? Who? Them? I don't think we should trust them, right? I mean, what are they trying to kidnap us? Jesus Christ, man. Stop being such a crybaby. They're not gonna kidnap us. Besides, I'm a soldier. I can beat their asses with one instinct. It's alright. They're not gonna kidnap us. Why don't we just get some sleep? It's gonna be a long way to get to that island again. Uh, I suppose you're right. I could use some rest. Well, night fellas. I'm going to night nights. Good night guys.